Alright, let's jump into it. Leather or rusty mail. Tell your friends about me. Quite a speech, a little bit, man. I've seen him before. 
At Torm, I got plenty of honor. Ryan, glad you finally made it. Um, just for your info, that stuff you were talking to me about on Twitter, let me go ahead and fill you in. This takes place when Ezio is 40 years old, so I think it's about 13 or so years before Revelations, and it takes place entirely in Rome. Um, so hopefully that gives you kind of an idea of where it takes place in the series. you do is exactly equal to the time it takes for you to talk. Perhaps if I break your arm... I bet you he's upstairs. Hang on. Yep. My boys will do something permanent to you in five seconds, me. <laughs> In peace. As you can see, Ryan, Ezio is definitely a lot you younger in this game. He's probably the best looking 40 year old I've ever seen. Allow me to serve you.
quick tour. Do you have any remarks as to how I handled that takedown? Yeah, Ryan, that's your question. It takes place, uh, if my timeline's correct, it's going to be about 13 years before Revelations. He's uh, 40 years old in this game, and I think when Revelations starts off, he's 52, 53, 54, somewhere around there. Um, let's see here. Let's see if there's any other assassin recruits I could gain. What do you think, guys? Can I make that jump? What do you think, Tor? I made it. Nice stretch. Down to hell. Be with the assassin on their train. You'll not survive. It's something that impresses me about this game, even though it's on a 360. I mean, if you look at this night sky, I mean, even on an old console like this, I think it still looks incredibly gorgeous. It looks even better on the uh, remastered version. But this was something I really, really appreciated about the game. It was just how incredibly lifelike the whole thing looked. And it still holds up very well for such an old console.
goes there? Salve to you too. Ezio! I was expecting my wife. Somehow that does not surprise me. The French putane have us under pressure. Tell me about their general, these Baron de Valois. Cesare persuaded King Louis to lend him an entire army to defeat me. I'm flattered. Where can I find him? It's only a matter of time before I have Valois by the throat. We have them in a retreat. They seem to be getting closer. The situation is under control. Close the gates! Bene, so maybe I could use a little help. All right, lost one of my guys there. Why don't you come closer and say that? You must learn how to speak French. It would mask your barbaric sensibilities. Perhaps you could teach me, and I would instruct you in fighting, since you seem to do so little of it. As amusing as this parley has been, I'd like your unconditional surrender before sunrise. Ha! My Lady Bianca will whisper it in your ear! I believe another lady might object to that. Mio marito vi ammazzerà tutti! I'll kill you for tutto francese! Calm down, for your wife's sake. You know my terms. Enter my camp unarmed at dawn. And practice your French. Soon all of Italy will be speaking it. I'll get you, pezzo di merda, figlio di puttana!
This is their camp. You steal a man's wife and then go hide inside a fortress? Nothing hangs between your thighs. In fact, there is a hole there. So I absolutely love this guy. I just gotta say that. Inferno. What good are you to our dead? We will regroup and fight through the gates as we did at the Arsenale. The entrance is thicker with Frenchmen than the streets of Paris. So we will climb the battlements. They cannot be scaled. But the Silea would know what to do. Maybe this is the end. I enter at dawn bearing gifts. And hope that coward spares her life. Perché non ci ho pensato prima? What did I say? Call your men back to the barracks. I will explain there. You better have something good. Fall back! Hey, by the way, Tor, I appreciate that useful information. I'll so, check that out after the stream. You have a plan. Once inside, your men can overpower the camp's patrols, correct? Yes, but... Especially if the patrols are taken completely by surprise. Ma certo. Then we need to liberate several suits of French armor. At dawn, we are going to walk right in. Ah! <laughs> Ezio Auditore! You are truly a man after my own heart. <laughs> Magnifico! I will get the armor. My troops will gather it from the dead. We will then depart from the north, so as not to arouse suspicion. And Ezio, make sure to kill them without a fight. The armor has to stay clean. Alright, now that is the fierce look of an assassin, if I ever saw one. Such pain as you have. Trust me, you'll soon feel much better, friend.
Thank you. Comments so far, Ryan? Any questions? Or are you just taking it all in? Killed all your buddies, and you apparently don't care at all. That's interesting. Hold there! Faster! Faster! You there! What do you think, guys? Should I go back and get him? Yeah, I think I should finish him. Yes, it actually does look very, very damn good, Ryan. Um, I would say, uh, probably out of all the 360 games, I think Revelations and Brotherhood are probably two of the best looking games that ever came out on the 360. And the remastered version is even more beautiful. Um, I'll stream the remastered version one of these days, but as gorgeous as everything looks, everything is just incredibly better on the uh, remastered. It's almost... Uh, hard to describe, but this game actually looked yeah, incredibly beautiful. I was blown away when it first came out, and it still held up very well, and Revelations has too. Um, Assassin's Creed 2 has aged a little bit harsher. Uh, I don't know what the deal was at the time. Um, the, the engine just wasn't anywhere near as good as this is, and it just wasn't as colorful, and the motion capture wasn't anywhere near as good either, and the characters looked kind of lifeless in certain scenes um, but but this thing has held up very very well
Okay, Tor, if I had no honor, I would have used this axe, okay? But I fought like a man. With honor. Alright, now right here is going to be a dishonorable act. I'm going to sneak up right behind this guy who really isn't paying a whole lot of attention to what's going on around him. There. Now that was dishonorable. Well, yeah, I fought in a cloud of smoke, but I was a part of that smoke, too. They just can't see as well as I can. They have the same disadvantage that I did. That's my story. I'm sticking with it. Oh, no. That one <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, another really big difference in this game versus Revelations, Ezio only has one particular bomb he can work with, uh, just a standard smoke bomb. He doesn't have the all the bomb crafting recipes that he had in Revelations, so you're a little more limited in this game. <laughs> of Roma has begun. Thank you, Signore. My life is worth nothing. But if it may serve you, I will consider it fulfilled.
Bring me a suit of that perverted armor. You are not wearing one. What? It is part of the plan. You surrender to us, we are bringing you to the Baron. Ah, yes. Then what? Your men attack on my signal. Bene! Go change into costume. Don approaches. Get into formation! i tell you what, it would take somebody that's really asleep at the wheel to fall for this trick. 20 of his guys turn up dead, and then all of a sudden, 20 just magically appear, wanting to come into his fort. I don't know if I'd fall for that. say I think this part is really glitchy primarily because the 360 has a really hard time handling this because you got so many NPCs on screen and you tend to get desynced a lot because I think the 360 and the PS3 just had a really hard time handling this but let's see We must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the French may think, Cesare intends to be king.
Well, that was luck. Great. That wasn't a glitch, that was just me running out of time and having bad tactics. We must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battle. Whatever the French may think, Cesare intends to be king. I was kind of covert. Y'all weren't looking at me. <sighs> we must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood. That lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the French may think, Cesare intends to be king. This mission is so frustrating. We'll get there. We must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the French may think, Cesare intends to be king. There's my problem. Apparently they don't get back and away when he's swinging because he's poisoned, so I'll have to change up on that. We must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the French may think, 
Cesare intends to be king. We must follow the patrol route. We cannot deviate or the Duke's men will know something is wrong. The Baron thinks Cesare will allow the French to rule Italy. He's so blinded by the trickle of royalty in his blood that lazy inbred can't see the battlefield. Whatever the French may think, Cesare intends to be king. <laughs> Your plan is brilliant, but I don't like using this kind of trick. I believe in fair fighting. May the best man win. Cesare and the Baron seem to have a different style. There will come a day in which men no longer cheat each other. And on that day, we will see what mankind is truly capable of. I have heard that before. It is something your father once wrote. I will take care of them. Good hide in here. Anyone see this? Infidel, black, so earth lover, no doubt.
Que venez-vous faire ici Mes soldats, conjouissent le capitaine italien à son excellence, le baron. Ils vous seront. What part of France are you from Montréal Open the gate Those speak French. There were a couple of French girls in Firenze. <laughs> Regardez-le Il a honte de ce qu'il est General Dalbiano, it seems that you have seen the light. Enough of your crap! Release my wife! Such entitlement from a man born with nothing to his name. Mine is worth its currency, unlike yours, which is counterfeit. How dare you? You think that commanding an army grants you nobility? Nobility comes from fighting beside your soldiers, not kidnapping a woman to cheat your way out of battle. Why don't you grow up here and release my wife? You savages never learn. Save my wife! Take the rooftops!
I got your wife killed, man. I only wanted respect. Respect is earned, nor inherited or purchased. Perhaps you are right. I need more time. Che tu sia pari nella morte, requiescat in pace. Basileia! Don't ever disappear again. I was lost without you. Really? But you rescued me. Ezio came up with a brilliant plan. I did not. It was all your husband's idea. It was? You are my prince. Now I better earn that title. You will. Thank you. Guys, it's been a fun night. I think I'm going to go ahead and call it here. Uh, appreciate y'all tuning in. I will definitely see y'all next time.